hey there everyone and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here first of all i just want to say happy new year it's been a few weeks since i filmed the video and what better way to start the new year off than with a good old zara haul um so yeah i'm gonna be showing you all the pieces that i purchased from zara um i hope that you guys had a you know had a wonderful holiday and you know spend it with the ones you love your friends and family and so I know even after the holidays things have been kind of crazy with what's going on in our country right now but you know I like to do things that make me forget about the craziness that's going on and fashion is just kind of one of those things you just have to do things just to kind of get your mind off the craziness and so that you don't go crazy yourself so yeah so I'm gonna be sharing with you guys some like I said some pieces that I purchased from Zara I got all these pieces I got in I think in the sale and I also got a few pieces from Mango as well because I love both those retailers. So, yeah, I'm going to show you just all the pieces that I got. I have some shoes, some handbags, and then, of course, some clothing pieces. So I'm going to share them with you right now. And I hope that you enjoy the video. And don't forget to like and subscribe if you do enjoy the video. So let's just get into it. Alright, so I think what I'm going to do is start with the shoes or the accessories first because I'm going to be, when you see like the styling portion of the video, you will see these pieces kind of, you know, mingled in with the styling of the pieces as far as clothing. So let me show you the accessories first, shoes and handbags. Alright, so the first pair of shoes I got are these like white mules. I hope the camera's not blowing them out too much, but they're like in this patent kind of leather i don't think it's real leather um yeah it doesn't say it's real leather um i got these on sale they're originally 49.90 but i got them on sale and i got them in a size 41 which is a us 10 so just some cute mules i don't have any i don't think i have any white mules so i thought these would be cute to add to my collection i'm i'm been trying to add pieces that i don't have um, if you've been a follower of mine, then you guys know I love fashion and I love to shop. But um, that's kind of like was my goal was to get pieces and add items to my wardrobe that I will have for years to come. Because this year, one of my plans, hopefully, and goals is to shop less and wear more of the pieces that I have in my wardrobe. We'll see how that goes. But yeah. So anyway, so I got these shoes. Again, I got these in a 10 and they're just some white mules. A uh, very reasonable um heel uh, height here um but yeah so got those and then the next pair of shoes i got are these like zebra print um loafers i love loafers and i love these because they're like textured i don't know if you can see that on the camera but they're like a textured kind of a print i don't know what you call this but anyway they're textured and so i got these in a size 41 again us 10 i think these were on sale for 20 dollars don't quote me on that but everything that I show you I will link below if it's still available if nothing's available I'll still link it just in case I think Zara by the time this video goes up I think they still have their sale going on they usually have that sale for a while so I will link all the Zara pieces as well as the mango pieces if they are still available um, but yeah so I don't have any uh, zebra print loafers so I have zebra print like mules but I don't have any loafers so these are kind of a more reasonable like everyday shoes so yeah i got those and then because i like those so much these were on sale as well and i like i think i like this print a little bit better they're also kind of like a textured kind of a material or fabric and again i got these in a size 10 and these look a little bit longer than the the loafers and the the uh than those um other loafers that i showed you they look they look a little bit longer i think because these are more the toe is more pointed as opposed to those that I just showed you they're more of a square toe I love a square toe heel or square toe in general um, but this is more of kind of like a rounded kind of toe it's a little square but it's more rounded off I would say than the other ones but I like these as well and so yeah these will go good with my neutral wardrobe so got those and then I also got this like kind of fur fur faux faux fur um handbag and it has like the pearl detail here on the handle part 
and I have one similar to this but it has like a basket kind of a weed detail that I got over the summer so it's very similar to that one and I like this one because this is more I would say like a fall and winter um, bag and the other one that I got that's more where the fur, the fur part is like in a basket weave and that's more of a spring summer so that's my justification for getting this bag okay um, but it's really cute very grandma chic I love that vibe and I love like it has like this kind of satin detail inside so that your stuff will be secure and it you know um, secures like this you just pull the string and it secures so um but yeah and it also comes with a little gold or chain handle or chain strap as well so you can wear it on your shoulder if you need to and so yeah so this was also on sale I think I paid $40 for it I'm not sure I will link everything below because I can't remember how much I paid um so yeah that's that one and then I'm in love with like texture I don't know I'm in love with texture things I don't know um so the next one I got is like this little like shoulder bag and you know these are super popular right now and it's just like in this kind of like shirling kind of a you know kind of material or fabric yeah shirling faux shirling fabric and it has like this gold detail here hardware that you can open um but it's pretty roomy as far as to you know to uh, carry around the stuff that I care about I don't carry around a lot of stuff so I like these small bags because of that um so yeah I got this one on sale as well and yeah the only thing is you can see the quality on this one um more so than the other one like some of the threads are coming off coming to loose but it's Zara so you know it ain't no big deal but yeah so that is the next bag that I got so all those accessories you will see styled in the try on portion of the video so um let's get into the clothing pieces so excited about those all right so the first thing I want to show you is this um, like sweater or like knit, knitted sweater and it has like this super huge like collar detail that goes all the way around I have been seeing this on the Zara website for a while and I was kind of wondering if I wanted to get it and I didn't want to pay full price for it so it was originally $49.90 so originally like $50 but of course I got it in a sale and I got this in a size US large and it also has the kind of um, detail here on the sleeve which is really cute um, I just thought it was just it's just a different take on a sweater I think and you know of course I love to layer so this kind of gives it that layering look without the bulk because you know sometimes you can layer and it's bulky so this looks like you have a shirt on under you know underneath the sweater but it's attached to the sweater so I like that and this goes great with a lot of the pieces that I've that I'm gonna show you so just a super versatile piece even with the little bib collar you know it's just so trendy right now and it's very Victorian and very like old school kind of vibes and the granny chic look that I like so but yeah so um got this in a size large and it fits me pretty well pretty it's not too big it's not too snug so um but yeah so that's the uh first clothing piece that I got and the next clothing piece I got are these trousers and they're just like this kind of um like check print kind of um detail and these actually look like they look like pajama bottoms and that's what my daughter said when she saw them she said mommy those are like pajamas and they and she's right they do that's the first thing i said when i when i got them online they didn't look like pajama bottoms but when i got them i was like oh those are like pajama bottoms but you know you can dress it up and style it up in a way where it won't look like pajamas but you know right now none of us are going anywhere really to dress up so this is appropriate I think for the times that we are in right now so um, I think in the try on portion I paired this with that um, sweater that I just showed you and I made it a look it's a, it's a dress up trouser pajama whatever is dressed up you know I made it work so yeah I got these um, trousers in a size extra large and they are they are a little kind of a little big on me I think I don't know why I got them in an extra large I'm thinking maybe they didn't have it in a large but I think on the site it recommended an extra large so that's fine I don't even go I don't you know it is what it is but they do fit me um, quite well and it's a very thin fabric so if you live in a cold climate and you get these you're gonna have to layer something like some tights or something because these 
this is not going to keep you warm and they are a little see-through too so i can see how they can very come off as um, pajamas because they're thin um but i can dress them up like i said i dressed them up with that top that i just showed you and i think it looked cute so yeah i just love these i don't have any trousers like this like i said i've been trying to get pieces um that i don't have in my wardrobe to you know kind of incorporate into my existing wardrobe so those definitely hit the spot so i'm gonna keep them yeah definitely gonna keep those all right and the next item i got are these trousers or they're more like leggings to me um and they're just like black leggings kind of like rib detail and they have like a little um kind of like a seam going down the middle and the seam opens up to a split at the at the uh the middle you'll see in the try on what i'm talking about but these are super stretchy they're called the zara high rise legging and i got these in a size large these were on sale as well and they're just i mean they're super stretchy these are most certainly a legging um and they are I'm trying to see if they are see-through i can't really tell but it's it's pretty it's pretty stretchy fabric so you know as leggings are so i mean they're just a good piece a good basic piece but i think the split down the middle at the um end makes them a little bit different and not just your regular old average leggings okay so i can wear these with multiple things in my wardrobe i have lots of oversized tops that i can pair with these just to kind of level up my legging game a little bit so yeah love those I have been seeing them and I was kind of debating whether I wanted to get them. I think they also have them or had them in a gray color. I don't know. I'm thinking about getting a gray color as well if it's still available. I don't know. But definitely you can't go wrong with black. Black goes with everything. So, All right. And the next item is this like um, it's kind of like a knitted kind of like hoodie. I guess you can call it. It's a hoodie but it's knitted. So it's like an elevated hoodie. Um, kind of like a dressed up version of a hoodie, but it is like a sweater um, fabric, but it is has a hood, like I said, a hoodie. <laughs> and I saw this and it's on the site and I thought it was, you know, really cute to kind of dress up or dress down. And I got this in a size extra small, small. So this definitely is like an oversized piece um, because I am not an extra small. I am for reference in case you're wondering, I am 5'7" and i'm like a size 10 on bottoms and like a medium medium to large up top so if that lets you know so you can kind of you know go do like the sizing kind of however you will um but yeah i'm definitely a medium and this fits me kind of big and oversized so this is definitely like the one of those pieces that meant that's meant to be oversized and i like it because you can you know put your hands here like a little pouch here so um it's just a good basic again you can't go wrong with something like this it will last you forever and you can dress it so many ways i think i dressed this with or dressed or styled this with the um leggings that i showed you so yeah just a super cute outfit or a piece that you can incorporate into any outfit and make it dressy or casual so all right and the next piece are these chocolate brown um chocolate brown culottes and these are so stretchy i put these on and i just couldn't believe how stretchy they were because you know normally like faux leather pieces are not stretchy from zara but this is pretty stretchy um and i got these in a size large did i say what size i got that yeah extra extra small small i was trying to decide if i said what size i got that um hoodie in or knitted hoodie um but these trousers and they just um, zip up on the side here and they're just uh, you know like a faux leather culotte in this chocolate brown i'm loving brown right now and i have brown faux leather brown um leggings that i got from zara but you know you can't go wrong with the culottes so yeah again like i said they're so stretchy which is very which is not very common with zara faux leather pieces so really happy about that but again this is i think i styled this with that um sweater with the little collar detail yeah just a, another basic staple item that you can style anyway with anything in your wardrobe so yeah i got that piece and then the next piece i got is this like i hope the camera the lighting is kind of blowing it up but it's like in this like caramelly beigey color i don't know what color to call this like caramel beige 
You may not be able to see it that well on camera, but you'll see it in the cutaway. And I love this, um, I saw it on the model and I thought it was really pretty. I love sweater dresses, just can't get enough of them. And this one I got in a size large and it fits, it fits kind of big on me. So I probably could, you know, would have to cinch it in with a belt to kind of further style it up. But I think in the try on, I just styled it with those white shoes, I think. Um, but yeah, this is just a good, again, layering piece. You can style it so many different ways wear it with so many different things. I just love pieces that, that you can just, you know, style so many different ways that are just versatile. So that's what that's what Zara is good for is having basic pieces that you can style multiple different ways. So I love this piece for that reason. And yeah, just a very neutral, neutral toned piece. The fabric is just really soft. So yeah, can't go wrong with that. So that's the next piece that I got. All right, and the next piece I got from Zara are these um or is this faux leather skirt and it's like a kind of like a I don't know if you call it like an a-line skirt um i don't have any i don't have any faux leather or black faux leather skirts actually no that's wrong i do i think it's from zara too but it's more of a pencil skirt so i love this because it's an a-line skirt so it's different you know from what i have um but i love this because it has has pockets here on the side and then it has like a split up the middle here and it looks like really good quality I got this in a size large and yeah just another basic item that like I said you can style so many different ways you can't go wrong with just a basic piece and I, I think I styled it with the same collar sweaters you can tell that's probably my favorite piece out of all these items I purchased that one's probably my favorite piece because that's not it's basic but it's not too basic it's not basic i mean that's kind of, that's more of a statement piece i would say so it's not it's basic but kind of a statement too um but anyway so yeah i love this skirt and yeah you can style that so many different ways casually or dressed up i mean you can't go wrong with a faux leather skirt if you don't have one you know i would highly highly recommend that you get one i recommend this one it's really nice and good quality so, all right, and the next item I got are these um, like knitted trousers or just a like knitted piece. And it actually, I got it to go with this knitted like turtleneck kind of a vest top. And this is made out of the same fabric, just this very soft fabric. And I got it to make a outfit with or a two piece set. Cause I love two piece sets. So first off, the bottoms, I got them in a size large and you can wear this as a loungewear set or you can wear it around the house casually um i like this one because it has like the turtleneck detail here um so you can wear you know a layering top underneath it kind of like what i'll show you that i got from mango i mean there's just so many ways that you can wear these like two-piece sets i just been loving them because you can you can make so many outfits out of a two-piece set you can wear them together or you can wear them separately and then style them different ways casually or dressed up so I love pieces like this because of the versatility so um, and I don't have one in this gray color I've been loving kind of loving gray here lately so had to get this um, so yeah I got the trousers or the pants in a large and the top I also got in a large so they fit me just perfectly so that kind of casual kind of slouchy kind of look um is what i was going for with these or with this um two-piece set so um but yeah so i got them in a gray color and of course when i like something in one color i tend to buy it in another color so i also got it in like this kind of off-white or ivory kind of color um and in the cutaway you'll see the cutaway i think i styled this one up with like a leather like a like a caramel leather coat and I think some heels so just to kind of show you the versatility of two piece sets like this I mean you can style them up in so many different ways and I just wear them casually you know it's something that you can wear around the house but it's also something that you can style up so when you're you know when we're able to go out and it's safe to go out you know to places um, then you know you have pieces that are versatile so you can wear them cat you you know casually or you can dress them up so I just kind of wanted to give you options and so I got this one in a size large I think I got the pants as well 
yeah I got the bottoms also in a size large so yeah I got the same piece just in this kind of ivory kind of oatmeal color so love those two pieces all right I think that's all the things I got from Zara and now I'm going to show you the things I got from Mango all right so the first thing I got from Mango is this cute skirt um, and it's just like in this checkered print or plaid however you want to call it and what I loved about this I love the, not only the print because it's like I don't know if you could tell on camera but it's like blue and brown and a little bit of burgundy in there which are so cute for the fall and winter time uh, but I also love it because it has like these fringe detail at the hem and also going kind of like on the side here you can see the fringe detail on the side of the skirt as well so I love this skirt it is a bit snug on me let's see I got it in a large I don't know mango pieces here lately have been fitting different or maybe I'm just gaining weight it's probably me it's probably not them it's probably me um but it's okay I'm gonna get I'm gonna lose some weight I am that's one of my goals for the uh, new year is to slim down a little bit and get rid of some of the quarantine weight that I gained last year um but anyway so yeah I love this skirt it's just very cute and I don't know I saw it in a very and it kind of gave me like retro vibes and kind of like Michael Kors Isabel Morant I'm loving if you follow those fashion houses I love like this how how their fashion is right now so much so very like old school and just you know classy kind of looks um, with a little bit of edge or a little bit of you know detail like the fringe so fringe if you didn't know it's a you know popping trend right now but even if it wasn't a trend I'd still buy this skirt just because it's different um, so this is like my statement piece but it's neutral so it can go for um, a piece it kind of looks like a when I hang it up like this it kind of looks like a scarf um, but anyway so it's neutral so it can be a piece that you can wear with different things like I can wear this with that same you know sweater that I showed you or with the uh, other pieces that I'll show you from mango but it's just a versatile piece like you can style it with different colors white cream you know brown you know blue any colors you can because it's just neutral so yeah I got that skirt and for the try on portion I think I styled it with this um, layering piece and it's super thin I have another one similar to this that I've showed in another mango haul and it's like in I think like an oatmeal color so I wanted to get more of these um, just like layering tops I mean they're super thin you can see straight through them but I purchased these as layering pieces to wear like with vests I think of this the try on portion I had it on with like a vest and I belted it so yeah so I, I got this to wear with sweater vests I have a whole bunch of them and I want to be able to wear them and be comfortable so pieces like this just very kind of thin fabrics um, that are good for layering or good good to wear with you know sweater vests so um, and I wanted one in a colorful piece because all my you can see all my items are neutral but this is like that pop of color so um, so yeah so I'll have this piece for you know a while and it's very stretchy and just durable and I got this one in a size large and yeah so just a good layering piece can't go wrong with that and it's like in this turtleneck yeah so a little keep you warm all right and the next piece I got is this faux leather like pretty caramel color like pencil skirt and um, this is a little bit snug on me I will I must admit I got it in a size US 10 so I'm not sure why it's snug because that's typically what I wear in skirts and dresses actually I'm usually a, a US 8 or in dresses and skirts so this is snug um, but the thing is to be fair it doesn't have any stretch it's not like those um, cool outside showed you showed you from Zara that have stretch this is no stretch whatsoever so yeah you you're gonna have to really get the size that you need or size up if you get this skirt because there's no absolutely no stretch to this but it is good quality I must say it's kind of like a shiny faux leather kind of patent leather I guess you could say um, skirt but I loved it because I don't have anything like this and I wanted to add it to my winter fall and winter wardrobe and yeah I, I love this and I'm not I'm not I'm not gonna take it back I'm gonna fit into this I'm determined I'm going to fit into this if not this year then by the, by the, end, of the, by the end of the year 
I will fit this. Hopefully I can start fitting this before the fall and winter season is up this year, but, or the winter season, I should say. But I love it. I loved it and I styled it up. It, it took a minute to get it on, I gonna lie. But um, it's a cute skirt nonetheless. And I, just, I love the color of, I think that's what I love it so much. It's just this beautiful, rich caramel color. I love that. So got that. And the last piece I got is just um, a layering piece, just like the red one that I showed you. I got it in this green color because I've just been loving green too. And I got this in a size, medium they must have been out of the largest um, but this fits just as fine like i said it's a layering piece so it will go underneath other items that i layer on top of it like sweater vests and so yeah um i loved it and i think i paired it with that um skirt and i had on some like brown boots and i think a cardigan so yeah i can wear this with a cardigan like i showed you or like you'll see in the styling portion or again a sweater vest so just a nice piece that, again, layering pieces are just good. I, I think majority of my pieces are in my wardrobe are layering pieces because in the, in the winter time, I like to be warm and cozy. And so I will put on as many layers as I need to, to ensure that I am comfortable in the colder months. All right, guys, well, that is it. That is all the items that I got from Mango and from Zara. Like I said, I will link everything that I can find down below. Even if it's not still available, I will still link it just in case. You can always hit the notify me button on anything and be notified when it comes back in stock. Cause you just, you just, you just never know. People are returning stuff that they got in Chris, you know, for Christmas. And so you may look up and find some of these pieces. To me, this is like a, a good capsule wardrobe. Like all these things can intermix and you can wear it with other pieces. Um, so yeah, that's, that's a good, a good starter. I would say a good starter. Cap, uh, capsule wardrobe collection for you so but I love every piece I'm planning on keeping everything not giving any taking anything back unless I change my mind um so yeah I hope you guys enjoyed the video and enjoy the styling part that I did and uh, this will probably be my last clothing haul for a while like I said I'm trying to cut back on the spending this year that's one of my goals I spent so much on clothes which is fine because I was trying to get my wardrobe ready to be more sustainable and to you know just wear for years and years and years you know so that's kind of like what's my goal is to create the perfect wardrobe so I think I'm think I think I'm good I think everything that I have my wardrobe now I love and I don't need to add anything but not to say I probably won't do any hauls but probably won't do as many I'll probably do more so styling videos with things that I already own so just look out for that and you know if you like styling um, videos then just like and subscribe because that's probably what you'll see more than likely is what you'll see on this channel from now here on out are styling videos with the occasional haul of clothes every now and again but for the most part trying to cut back on that for this year we'll see how it goes though um but thank you guys so much for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video and to also hit the notification bell so that you don't miss any videos i try to upload every wednesday and sunday but that may change um as i re kind of revamp this channel a little bit um but yeah so that's enough rambling thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you guys in my next video stay safe and love one another because after all that's all we really have is love all right see you guys next time bye